Hello there. Dr. Bill Crawford here, psychologist, speaker, author of four books, host of two PBS specials. Here today to bring you another tip on how to help you create the life you want. How to bring more clarity, confidence, creativity into everything you do. Recently, I was reading a book. came out this year. It's called Bold. And the authors talk about three components that I think would be helpful for us to keep in mind as we go about creating the life we want. They talked about the importance of autonomy, purpose, and mastery. And I thought those might be good to look at one at a time to see how that might help us create the life we want. For instance, autonomy. One of the things I talk about in my book and my seminars is you never want to make the most important thing in your life something that is beyond your control. You've got to have autonomy over something in your life in order to be able to create the life you want. I think often what we try to control is other people or traffic or situations or jobs or things that are not within our control. Now, I'm a big fan of influencing those, but there's a difference between influencing something and needing it to be a certain way before we can be happy. So the idea is what I encourage people to do is to look at their sense of self-definition, the statement they want to make about who they are, the qualities and characteristics they would bring to a situation if they were doing it in a way they would recommend to someone they love. I call that our highest purpose. And in many ways, it combines the first two elements of the author's concept of autonomy and purpose because we can control the qualities and characteristics we bring to life. If we decide we want to bring clarity, confidence, creativity, compassion, curiosity, uh, patience, understanding into a situation, we can do that. We have the power to do that, especially as it becomes our highest purpose. If we can make that the most important thing we do, then everything else falls underneath that. And the beautiful thing about making, bringing the best to our best of life, our highest purpose, or the most important thing we do, is then everything else we do comes from the top of the mind, because these are top of the mind qualities. We are accessing that clarity, confidence, and creativity that come from the upper 80% of the brain. In doing so, we deal with life so much better, traffic so much better, our kids so much better, our work so much better, our school so much better. If we're able to define who we are, have that autonomy to be able to do that because nobody else can keep us from doing that, really. Nobody else, they might, that, that might be more challenging around certain situations to certain people, but it is always within our control. And when we make it our highest purpose, the most important thing we're going to do in life, then we can begin to be successful because we have those first two components of success, autonomy and purpose. What about mastery? Do we have to become masters at this before we can reap any benefit? I don't think so. I think mastery is a wonderful idea, but mastery is really something you work toward. Musicians work toward mastery, but they never get to the point where they stop working. Athletes work toward mastery, but they're always improving. So the idea is to see mastery as a process, not as an end result. Something that I'm practicing, something that I'm working toward so that I use the situations that I find myself in to practice this autonomy and purpose, to practice defining myself in a way that, that I would recommend to someone I love. And I'm not talking about defining myself in terms of what other people see. They will see it. But this is from the inside out. Who am I from the core when I'm going into a challenging situation or any situation? Because if we start practicing in those less than challenging situations and get good at that, it's easier to take them into the, those more difficult or challenging situations. So I'm going to encourage you to look at these three components, autonomy, purpose, mastery. Ask yourself, how are you bringing those to life? Are you controlling what you can? Are you taking 100% responsibility for those qualities and characteristics you're bringing to life. That's where your autonomy rests. And when we can control those, when we can influence those, we can then deal with those situations that are beyond our control so much better. When that becomes our highest purpose, we bring that second component of purpose into the process. 
It is now what we focus on. It is now everything we're looking to. And when we do that before we go into a situation, here's my highest purpose, here's what I'm going to bring into that situation, we go into the situation already in the top of the mind. And then mastery. We want to practice until we become masters. And even when we become masters, we want to keep practicing. Because life will always give us plenty of opportunities to practice. And anything we practice, we'll get good at. So what would it be like if you were practicing this autonomy and purpose, making that your highest purpose, getting better and better and better at bringing those qualities to life in a way that you would teach to someone you love? How would that enhance the quality of your life? I hope you're finding these videos enjoyable. I'm having a wonderful time bringing them to you. If you do, please hit the like button. You know how Facebook and Google and YouTube really love it when people like it. Share it with your friends if you find it valuable. That is also really important. If you have questions or comments, feel free to put them down there. I read them all. I will try to respond to all of them. If you want me to come and do a presentation to your organization about how to bring more um, autonomy mastery, purpose to what everyone does, all you got to do is go to my website, BillCrawfordPhD.com, hit the contact button, let me know what you're interested in, and I would love to talk with you about that. In the meantime, here's to you bringing more clarity, confidence, and creativity into everything you do, more autonomy, purpose, and mastery into everything you do, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.